Credential stuffing impacts all verticals. Any organization that has a public-facing login is impacted by credential stuffing. You know, once you're, you've gotten rid of the credential stuffing, there are all sorts of other types of automated and manual attacks that enterprises need to be concerned about. Depending upon the vertical, you might see different types of automated attacks, manual attacks and fraud. For example, e-commerce. We might see lots of attacks against the check gift card balance endpoint. In financial organizations, we'll see attacks against create account for the purposes of creating a bunch of synthetic accounts for money laundering. And then for service providers, uh, we'll see attempts to take over the account because then they have access oftentimes to a portal where they can see text messages, which would include 2FA text messages. In general, the way these attacks work is they start with network level attacks where they're using tools like Curl or Sentry MBA. Then they, they use specialized tools where they're programmatic controlling browsers, and then eventually they, they evolve to human click farms. And those are the most sophisticated of all attacks to try and prevent. The SHAPE solution is making sure that attackers get no return on their investment, especially when they're targeting one of our customers. The SHAPE platform works by collecting and analyzing telemetry signals and learning normal and malicious patterns for organizations of similar attack profiles, risk surfaces, and industry verticals with the assumption that motivated cyber criminals will try to circumvent all security countermeasures. By making things difficult, we encourage them to abandon their attacks and find an easier target. So some of the key differentiators for F5 Shape are, uh, first and foremost, the way we obfuscate our JavaScript and protect our signals. At Shape, our JavaScript changes the bytecode every five minutes, making it very, very difficult to protect. The second is we handle stage two. Uh, we provide the humans, we provide all the AI and ML, we handle all of that. And then finally, the Shape network. Uh, we're able to get visibility across virtually every vertical, regardless of the CDN that they happen to be using. So if all of this is left to the enterprise, then you have just a bunch of stovepipes that aren't closely coordinated. When all of this is done as a managed service in a way that is agnostic to the CDN or to the cloud, uh, then you can have meaningful countermeasures to some of these attacks.